What's up guys, it's Brandon here from Lake Kicker Scuba and Marina. If you are new to our channel, do me a huge favor. Hit this little subscribe button right here and ding that little bell as well. That way you guys are going to be notified every time we upload new content. Now here behind me is the beautiful Blue Heron Bridge. And if you look over here to the left, you'll see that's kind of the beach area. If you've never dove here before, it's a free dive. You basically get to come in for free. There's a lot of parking. You walk in straight on the beach and they've got a little divers area out here. I'll show you a little bit about it, kind of show you a map of the area, what it looks like. But you can go out and this is a great place to, to take open water students, rescue students, navigation students, search and rescue students. It's relatively shallow, max depth is only about 25 feet during high tide, but it's a great place to come out here and train. However, we're not going out to the bridge today, we're going out on a charter boat today. And we've been actually diving with this charter all week as well. It's Ocean Quest Scuba, I'll drop all their information down below. But I just want to show you some of the things that you're going to see here in West Palm Beach, Florida, if you decide to come down here diving. There's such a wide range of wildlife underwater that you're pretty much going to see on every single dive. Now, a lot of people say, well, all coral reefs are the same. And yeah, technically they are. You're going to see a lot of the same wildlife. However, to, to see the diversity that you see here is just unbelievable. Yesterday we were out here diving, we saw up to four sharks, we saw three or four turtles, we saw squid, we saw octopus, uh, you name it, we saw it. And to be able to see that much diversity on one dive versus what I did say last week down in Mexico, it's just amazing. It's a really, really inexpensive trip down here. It's something that you need to check in. There's plenty of charters. We just happen to like Ocean uh, Quest Scuba here. But come out here to West Palm Beach, do some diving, go hit the bridge back here and dive around it. It's a really neat experience as well. But I'm gonna quit blabbing. I'm gonna go ahead and jump in and make a quick little dive here and just show you some of the stuff that you can see diving down here in West Palm Beach. guys as you can see we had an absolutely amazing dive a ton of wildlife we saw all different types of species and it's a fun dive most of the dives down here are drifts so you just jump in relax the current's going to push you and you're going to see a wide range of diversity as far as ecologies here in west palm beach 
Guys, I really hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give me a big thumbs up. If you got any questions about coming to West Palm Beach and diving, or even diving the Blue Heron Bridge here, let me know down in the comment section and I'll try to answer it. I've got a ton of content coming up for you guys. I'm actually headed to the Mares and SSI headquarters down in Boca Raton in about 30 minutes. As soon as I get off the boat, I'm gonna head down there. The group of divers I got here on the boat with me, they're all getting a private tour of SSI and Mares, so I'm gonna take them down there. And then next week, I'm flying out to Los Angeles, California to train a research company out there of how to use underwater communications and full face masks. So we're gonna be filming a con ton of content out there as well, so stay tuned for that. Guys, like I said, if you like the video, give me a big thumbs up, share it. If you got any questions, drop me a comment down below, and I'll try to answer it as quickly and as best as I can. Guys, I really hope you did enjoy the video. I'm gonna go ahead and sign off for today. Take care, God bless, and I'll see you in the next video.